In this video, we'll talk about creating the right environment for productivity. The first steps towards becoming more productive is to create the right environment. You can't triple your productivity if you're surrounded by distractions and clutter. Here's some expert advice to help you achieve this goal. Whether you're working from home or in an office, these tips will help you get off to the right start. Top tips for setting up a highly productive office. Creating a workspace that is geared up for productivity is the key to getting more done in less time. Here are some surefire ways to give yours an overhaul. Remove anything which isn't related to a project you're working on right now. Any project more than three months old needs to be removed from your immediate work area. This improves your focus and keeps you productive. Make a daily to-do list to follow. This keeps your day on track. Break up the day into segments and assign tasks to each segment. One trick used by experts is to add a couple of tasks you've already done to your to-do list. This gives you a mental boost and pushes you to accomplish more goals. Try color coding your materials. Colors helps to improve your mode and evoke perceptions. This improves your outlook, helping you to achieve more at work. On a practical level, it also helps you to see at a glance what relates to each project. As a result, you'll save time that would otherwise have been spent searching for things. Use a timer. A timer helps you manage your time more effectively and enables you to track your progress. When you're at work, it's all too easy to lose a sense of time. This means you can end up spending too long on certain tasks. Decide in advance how long you need to dedicate to a particular job. Then use the timer to track that length of time. This gives you a better sense of how long each task requires to complete. Keep your phone close at hand. This ensures you don't need to leave your seat to answer a call, saving you time. Stand up your file folders. Files take up a large amount of space when lying flat. Use a desktop filling box that has a minimal footprint but helps you to stay organized. This will also keep important documents within arm's reach. Adjust your computer monitor. Craning your neck to see your monitor impacts on your productivity. Make sure you choose the right viewing angle for you. This reduces fatigue, improves your concentration, and thus, your productivity. Think vertically. Your desk may be horizontal, but there's plenty of vertical space below and above it. Utilize it to the max. Store writing utensils under your desk, or use monitor risers to use the space under your monitor. Better desk organization means better productivity. Put up family photos. This helps to create an encouraging and positive environment at work. If you're feeling stressed, seeing the reasons that you go to work helps to boost your productivity. Brighten your space. Light has a key role to playing in boosting your mental health and helping you to stay positive. This, in turn, makes you more productive. Try to maximize natural light in your workspace. Follow these top tips and you'll find that your work environment boosts your productivity. Working from home? How to set your workspace up for maximum productivity. If you work from home, there are multiple distractions that can affect your productivity. Avoid those distractions by setting up the workspace for maximum productivity. Here are some top tips to follow. Find the right workspace for you. Everybody works differently. You may find that you work better at your kitchen table or in your bedroom. You might prefer to work by a window or by a wall. Finding the best spot for you is key to getting more done. If you're setting up a home office, you can design a room that is a highly productive space. Set yourself up close to a power outlet. You'll probably be working from your phone and laptop. This means you need constant access to power. Don't waste time by having to charge up your devices in a different room or away from your desk. Choose a well-lit space. Working in the dark reduces your productivity. Whenever possible, choose a space with plenty of natural light. Make sure you also have a lamp nearby so you don't strain your eyes. Add touches to motivate you. When you work at home, you aren't restricted by office rules. That means you can add anything you like to your workspace. Green plants are nice touches in workspaces to improve positivity. Add photos of your loved ones or motivational quotes. Anything to make you feel good and keen to get to work. Remove the TV. If you're working in a public area of your home, make sure the TV isn't on. They reduce your productivity. Even if you can hear the television from your home office, you can be distracted. Make yourself comfortable. Find ways to make your workspace as comfortable as possible to boost your productivity. Choose a chair that supports you and reduces back pain. Make sure your laptop is at the right height for you. Open a window or adjust the air conditioning. Avoid distracting people. There are many benefits to working from home. However, there are some negatives too. One of the biggest is that there are probably going to be other people around. This can be a major distraction. When you work in an office, everyone around you is focusing on the same type of tasks. This minimizes the distractions associated with other people. 
At home, however, your children, pets, housemates, or partner are all engaged in their own thing. It can be all too easy to get caught up in their activities rather than your own. It's also very common for those around you to forget that you're supposed to be working. Children often come in asking you to play. Housemates may come and ask you about preparing dinner or household chores. Your partner might pop in to engage you in conversation. None of this is helpful for your productivity. Even friends can be a problem. When you work from home, many people fail to recognize that you're working. They wouldn't dream of visiting you at work for a coffee and a chat. Yet, they think nothing of coming around during your workday. This isn't just distracting, it stops you getting work done. As a result, you become overwhelmed and non-productive. Establishing boundaries for your home working life is therefore vital. Set rules for your loved ones. Make sure they know that they're not allowed to disturb you between certain hours. Make sure that you also adhere to those working hours. Don't allow yourself to be distracted. If someone comes in to talk to you during this period, you must reinforce the rules. Don't give in and be persuaded to play or chat. Gently remind the disturber that you're working and they need to wait until you're done. It isn't easy to establish these boundaries. However, when the message finally gets through, you'll find working from home becomes substantially easier.